Welcome to the weather briefing from the National Weather Service in San Diego. This is Alex Tardy, a meteorologist here at the National Weather Service San Diego office. We are going to take a look at the weather pattern change that is possible late next week or the end of this month, and it could bring a significant storm system to California. This video is about four minutes long. Here's a look at the precipitation over the past 30 days or about one month. This shows the percent of normal. You can see in Southern California, most areas less than 25% of normal. Very little precipitation, mainly from a couple small storms early in the month. Across the rest of the state, a little bit better for the Northern Sierra Nevada, North Coast regions where it's been a little bit above normal. But if you take a look in the left-hand side, the long-term drought remains with a solid grip over California with a large area of extreme to exceptional drought for most of California. What is the weather pattern that could occur later next week, Wednesday through Friday or February 26th through 28th, likely continuing into March 1st? The weather pattern looks like this for next week. On Wednesday, the left-hand image, upper-level high pressure will bring warm conditions to the west. However, notice there is an indication of a piece of the jet stream moving underneath this upper-level high pressure system as deep low pressure carves across the North Pacific. Also, deep low pressure presses southward as it has much of this winter across the Great Lakes. Then on Friday, notice the storm system becomes stronger and a lot of energy moves underneath the upper level ridge as it does not move and moves directly into California potentially. What is the probability of this being a significant storm system? This shows here the blue and the yellow shadings are targeting central and south central California for a potential significant storm system or greater than 80th percentile for precipitation in the period the end of this month through March 1st. The confidence in this forecast, well, our numerical weather prediction, our average forecast has considerable confidence in this pattern because it's what we called amplified. We have a large high pressure system that extends across the west coast all the way up into Alaska and a couple trains of deep low pressure systems moving across the Pacific, as well as a deep low out near Hudson's Bay in Canada affecting eastern U.S. So the orange shade is high confidence of this weather pattern being predictable by our numerical weather prediction as shown here. What are the impacts in terms of precipitation? Well, we expect in the outlook here, February 27th through March 1st, the end of this month and early March, we expect a high probability of above normal precipitation during that period for central and perhaps northern California and reaching just into southern California as well. Our precipitation forecast only goes out through seven days, but here it shows precipitation already reaching much of California through February 26th of next week. And again, this precipitation is expected to continue into the 28th and even into March 1st, potentially, as this large, slow-moving storm system approaches. Make sure you check the latest hazards from the National Weather Service at the link here, weather.gov San Diego, for your watches, advisories, and warnings. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Be prepared. As a weather-ready nation, the National Weather Service is here to serve its citizens.